Hi Aquarius, Power and Light Tarot coming at you with the love reading. And Aquarius, this is going to be what are their true intentions in love, okay? And this is going to be a love reading about you and your person. <clears throat> Please keep in mind they're general so they may not resonate. And your person's energies could be throughout the reading, right, wherever. So please feel free to swap around the characters. And at the bottom of the deck here, Aquarius, is the King of Swords in the reverse. This could be you showing up in the reverse because of any situation that may not be favorable to you. And the Two of Pentacles is here. Nine of Wands in the reverse. And the Queen of Pentacles. And the Hangman. Wow, the Hangman's been showing up all day. And the Five of Pentacles. Let's take this uh, King of Wands here. And, wow, we have a lot of cards here. I feel like uh, what could be going on, somebody, maybe you are unable to decide whether or not you want to let somebody come back in. Or uh, you could also be uh, maybe trying to figure out if somebody is trying to, like, get back in with somebody else, right? Yeah. I feel like there could be an Earth sign here and a King of Wands. So, to me... There might already be a third party in the mix, right? Somebody's feeling stuck about uh, about a situation. And I feel like, you know, about trying to maybe let somebody back in. But I feel like this is you, and you're unable to make a decision. Two of Pentacles, King of Swords. Mm -hmm. And it could be because somebody was juggling, right? That could be uh, part of the equation, part of a tough decision maybe. Right now, Aquarius, you have the Page of Pentacles. Let's see and make sure these are not in the reverse because I'm kind of famous for that stuff. Yes, I am. Okay, so let's see what we have. And crossing you is the Eight of Wands. Your person looks like, like they want to take some, they look restless here, like they want to take action quickly. Could be about a decision, could be about, you know, actually taking action. And let's see, I feel like there's an ending here because the world card and the nine of pentacles, right? This talks about becoming single or just being single. And the world card talks about typically both an ending and a new beginning. So let's see why you are in the Page of Pentacles energy, Aquarius. King of Cups and the Star card. This is you, Aquarius, most likely. I feel like you're in this energy here where you can't have something that you want. Page of Pentacles in the reverse, yeah. And the Page of Pentacles in the reverse can speak of somebody who, who like, makes an offer, but it's not, like, valid. It's not real. If they're not being earnest about it, no, it can be, yeah, it can be that. And you could be dealing with a water sign here with that King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. Crossing you is the Eight of Wands. Nine of Swords, wow. So you're in this energy where you're worried about the situation, you're worried about change, yeah. I feel like this Page of Pentacles is in the reverse because somebody else has this, like a new start with someone else. Mm -hmm. Temperance, I feel like you're dealing with a Sagittarian, possibly. Doesn't always have to be, but you could be maybe, you could be thinking that somebody's going to balance it out with somebody else. Why it's all happening is you could be feeling stuck or having fear. I feel like you're, you're fearful here because somebody's leaving. Six of Swords. Yeah. What you want is the Ace of Cups and the Seven of Swords. <laughs> Showing up with the Nine of Cups in the reverse. You could really want... It's, it's a possibility you want to be with somebody who is sneaky here, right? Or so the same person here... Because there is a third party here, right? There is, and you could be simply, it could be showing up that you really want to be with them, even though they are, like, deceptive. But this could be saying that you don't have the courage because maybe they were deceptive. And this could be saying that you want a third party with somebody else. Yeah, you do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's see as we go. The Knight of Swords is your person's energy. 
Five of Swords. Two of Swords. Your person doesn't know what to do <clears throat> about a situation, about this, uh, about, like, about a third party here. But they could be in chaos and conflict. I feel like they are. It could be about you. This could simply be you, this Knight of Swords. And I feel like what this is saying is that they don't know what to do about, yeah, about the situation. About this chaos and this chaotic situation they feel like they're in. Crossing them is the Four of Wands in the reverse. This is a breakup. And the Knight of Pentacles is here uh, because there is most likely a Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. Could be a Capricorn in this reading. Because in the root for you, Aquarius, is the devil. I feel like you're dealing with a, with a Capricorn. Yeah. So now we see, I feel like what's happening, yeah, your person, uh, you could be opening yourself up to other opportunities, Aquarius. You could. And they could. It's depending on who is. This could be saying your person's also, if they are in a third party, they don't know like how to handle it. They could be feeling in chaos and conflict themselves. In other words, of what they have done. And the Nine of Pentacles is in the root for them. This is the card of being single and abundant and productive and etc. The Tower, Six of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like your person is becoming single here. Either because... Uh, they have a third party or you do either one moon card in the reverse I feel like a secret was exposed here mm -hmm. let's get a card on that moon card why is that there please seven of cups For me, this is a secret, and your person is be like they. I feel like they're becoming single. I feel like you could be leaving them. Yeah, I feel like you're leaving them, because they had a third party. I feel like that's what it is, and now they don't know what to kind of do about the situation. Yeah, I feel like there was a secret exposed here. Yeah. And what they want is the Ace of Swords. Why would they want the Ace of Swords? Five of Cups. Four of Pentacles. So they want to hold on to somebody. At the same time, they are in, uh, they're grieving a situation. Your person could be wanting two people here. Mm -hmm. Ace of Swords. I feel like they're trying to gain clarity here, possibly too. They could be just want, simply wanting to gain clarity on a situation that they are grieving because maybe you are holding on to somebody else. Mm -hmm. It's just going to depend. I feel like you are in the situation. <coughs> going to end the reading there. We're going to find out over on Vimeo, you guys, where the tell-all lives. Yes, it does. We're going to find out what they would want to say to you, Aquarius, how they feel about you, what is blocking them, what they're hiding, what they're fearing, what they really want, and their true intentions. On Vimeo, all the extended readings are super affordable. Please give a thumbs up, you guys, if you got a message. Don't forget to share and subscribe. And if you guys need your own reading, it's always the best way. Thank you so much.